CCTV footage of Kim Seon, an accident has been revealed. The actress was caught driving under the influence, causing massive traffic violation and damages. News channel YTM revealed the CCTV footage during their news broadcast. According to the CCTV footage, Kim Seon was driving a black SUV. The footage shows Kim Seon making a left turn into a large street. The car, however, overturns and drives into a guardrail and electrical transformer. The car then backs up and continues driving through the street. Upon seeing the footage, netizens did not hold back their disappointment. Netizens criticized Kim Seon for continuing to drive even after the multiple collisions, saying that it was a dangerous situation for other drivers and pedestrians, some comments being she could have stopped after the first accident. I can't believe she continued to drive. Super lucky that there wasn't anyone hurt. Wow, this is shocking. On the morning of May 18th, Kim Seon was booked under the suspicion for driving under the influence the actress is said to have been so drunk that she couldn't speak clearly the actress refused a breathalyzer test and was taken to a nearby hospital for a blood test by crashing into an electrical transformer kim seron cut off electricity to a signal light causing massive delays for morning commuters now, Kim Seon's apology is met with mixed responses from netizens. Netizens have shown a mixed response to Kim Seon's apology. The actress apologized on the night of May 19th, a full day and a half after the actress's DUI investigation was first reported. Kim Seon apologized for the late apology, stating it was due to the resolving issues surrounding the accident. The actress admitted she was drunk driving and stated that she was working to resolve the damages resulting from the accident, saying, I should have acted more responsibly, but I failed to do this. The actress also apologized to the staff and fellow actors of, of upcoming projects she had been working on. The actress was in the middle of filming for Netflix's K-drama Bloodhounds and had just finished filming the movie Us Day by Day. Netizens who saw the apology have shown a mixed response. Some fans consoled the actress saying, it's okay if you repent, just don't let it happen again. I will root for you. Everyone makes mistakes and I hope you learn from this. Other netizens, however, were not so understanding, saying, how can you say it's okay? Drunk driving can be murder. We can't let her off easy just because she's a celebrity. Why are there so many hearts in the comment section of a DUI apology? Okay, now here is my take on this whole story. It's not the first time us as K-pop fans or K-drama fans have heard of DUI incidents. We've seen it honestly sadly many times before but in my opinion my own opinion i honestly think this is kind of being a little bit hypocritical just over the fact that if we compare it to a different case of drunk driving like ab6's former leader young Min, he had to leave his group and relinquish his title and basically right. got ostracized and humiliated because of what he did yet for her people are accepting a sorry and one little instagram posts and paying for some damages no i definitely think there should be a lot more of a repercussion for her i think she should lose the dramas that she's working on right now like hellbound in the movie that she filmed day by day and she should also have her license suspended for at least three years because i definitely i just want there to be some sort of repercussion because we see this so many times and i don't think an apology suffices like you going on instagram and just posting it and plus we don't even know if it was her who posted that apology if it was her who ran it and not her company we don't know we don't know if she's actually remorseful if she's just saying that to save face that's one of the biggest things i definitely think korea's laws should be a lot more stricter when it comes to drunk driving just because of how big drinking culture is in korea but I'm just very disappointed. I think people who are getting older and who are able to drive and given that responsibility to drive should be a lot more mindful and just smart, a lot more smart and just care for their safety, the safety of other people who could be in the car with them, and the safety of the pedestrians and people who are outside that might enjoy the pain and suffering that they may cause by their action. So I just want to see more repercussions for people who do this and I honestly don't think just one apology suffice and could change what happened. But that's my opinion on this definitely. I want to know what you guys think about this whole situation in the comments down below. Do you think an apology is all she needs to give or do you think there should be a harder punishment that she receives? I'll definitely keep you updated on this case until you have anything, anything more right. comes out. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. I love reading your comments. I like all my comments. If you don't believe me, check the other videos. I like every single comment. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.